Okay, let's continue. So the next speaker is uh, Rio Akava from uh, Osaka Metropolitan University. Uh, and he will talk about uh, case theoretic wall crossing formulas and multiple uh, basis hypergeometric series. Yeah, th thank you very much for the uh, introduction. Uh, and I thank all the organizers for uh, giving me this opportunity to talk here. Uh, and so, as I, uh, I, I introduce, uh, I, today I will be talking about case theoretic wall crossing formula. Yes. And uh, th th this is a joint work with Junichi uh, Shiraishi. So first of all, I uh, talk about back background of this work. Uh, so uh, I uh, so first uh, th this method was developed by Ta Takuro Mochizuki. Uh, uh, this uh, this is uh, for modular of parabolic Higgs bundle on surface, and then uh, Nakajima Yoshioka interpreted in terms of cleaver. So this is uh, for fr framed modular on the blow up. Uh, so today I will be talking about modular of fr framed cleaver representations. So first of all, uh, in, in the section one, I. I'm talking about residue formula for glass manian manifold. And uh, second, I will uh, introduce uh, general setting of framed cleaver representation. And finally, I will uh, be talking about chainsaw cleaver variety. And uh, I will give you some conjecture about uh, generating functions of integral. And uh, I, I, I gave a proof uh, for special case of in this conjectures. So let W be R dimensional vector space, V uh, uh, D dimensional vector space. Uh, we consider the injective map from V to W. Uh, we, then we, we have a conjugation. Uh, we, we have a general linear group actions. And this uh, gives a quotient space. Uh, this is isomorphic to Grassmannian, uh, sending uh, linear maps to the image in ambient Ws. So we, we have a diagonal action on Grassmannian. Uh, this is a subspace, sub. sub uh, this is uh, sorry. this is a su sub subgroup of general linear group of W. Uh, then we, we have a fixed point set uh, parameterized by D uh, su subset of R elements with cardinality D. So this is given by the sub-vector space corresponding to this finite set. So we, we, we have a, uh, we, we have a, a n number of the fixed point sets uh, equal to by binomial coefficients, yeah. so which is uh, equal to the Euler numbers of Grassmannian. So, uh, so this is a prototype of our uh, computations. So, uh, we we compute we will compute this Euler number by localization method. So, let us introduce. Uh, some no notations. So we consider the algebraic variety M. Uh, in most cases, uh, this is uh, smooth. And the uh, uh, vector bundle on M. Uh, then uh, we check 
denotes the dual of the E. And uh, wedge E equals, wedge E denotes exterior products of E. Then uh, we consider the cotangent bundle of M. So this gives, uh, so we, th this is a uh, complex of uh, differential forms. So we, we take a homology. homology. Uh, so if we take a cohomology, then we, we get the Euler number. So we, we will recall that Euler number is computed by K-theoretic localizations. And furthermore, uh, we will recall K-theoretic Euler number gives T analog of uh, this uh, binomial coefficients. So this is a uh, uh, T analog of integer N, T integer N. So we, let us introduce T equivalent K group, uh, which is a free group generated by T equivalent vector bundle and modulo uh, some relations. Uh, so when M is the point, uh, this gives a, uh, so T, T equivalent vector bundle of a point is nothing but uh, T representation. So this is equal to the low round polynomial. And where variable denotes, variable corresponds to the weight space. Yes. So the localization formula is given by as follows. So let us assume M is that smooth T equivalent variety. And then we consider the uh, embedding of the fixed point set. Then, uh, then we, we have a three facts. We use the following three facts. So the push forward of the iota star gives the isomorphism after the localization. And uh, the fixed point set has decomposition into submanifolds. And finally, uh, if we write normal bundle of these components and J, then uh, epsilon, uh, so the inverse image of epsilon is given by the following formulas. So, so we can summarize this into this diagram. So we, we have a, a isomorphism by uh, Yota star inverse. Then we get, uh, uh, we get, uh, then we, uh, we, we, we have a projection from each connected components. So the localization formula gives uh, this equality. Uh, where the uh, left-hand side is just a uh, uh, cohomology, taking cohomologies. And we regard the right hand side as uh, the, so we, we regard the sum and of right, right hand side as a, a integral over the connected, compo uh, co connected components. So then, uh, usual Euler number uh, is computed as enumeration of the fixed point. So we, we have uh, this kind of, uh, we have this uh, binomial coefficients. 
Uh, on the other hand, uh, we, we, we define K-theoretic Euler number by uh, taking weight space. Then we get the uh, um, this kind of uh, ra rational, ra rational function. So we can show that this is equal to T analog of binomial coefficients using wall crossing formula, which is the prototype of the, uh, our method today. But here I, I want to uh, show this by another method. So this is uh, yeah, you, by, given by McDonald's theory. Maybe uh, most of people know more than me, but uh, I, yeah, I was taught from Professor Nogi this, by this, uh, uh, this, about this method. So let us introduce McDonald's operator here. And then it, it is known that the elementary symmetric polynomial and the McDonald's symmetric polynomial satisfy this equation. So, McDonald polynomial is uh, 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 McDonald symmetric polynomial is a uh, eigenvector, and the uh, elementary symmetric function is eigenvalues. Then we we can uh, we we have uh, specialized this equation. So let the uh, delta be the, this partition, and lambda be an arbitrary partition, and we set t to the delta and q to the lambda by this way. Then, in particular, we, we take uh, lambda is, we take lambda uh, equal to empty set. And then we get the uh, 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 left hand side. On the, on the other hand, right hand side gives a uh, uh, elementary symmetric function. Uh, then the hook length formula gives a T analog of the binomial coefficients. T uh, 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 I'm sorry, maybe, maybe Q, Q shift operator. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah. yes, yeah, thank you. So, so this is the prototype, but uh, I here in this section, I, I, I'd like to introduce uh, another formula uh, called the residue formula. So let's uh, E be n-dimensional represent GLV representation. Then we can define vector bundle over Grassmannian. Then we can consider the cohomology as a rational function over equivalent parameters. So, typical example is universal subbundle of Grassmannians. So, then our theorem is the uh, integral, the Cohomology is given by this kind of residue formula. So th this is uh, pr proven by Weber Zillian qubits first. And uh, I gave a, uh, I, I reproved this theorem by another method. So where f is the character of if e, and uh, residue means composition of residues. Yes. So I want to uh, explain the left hand, right hand side. So let uh, H be the complete homogeneous symmetric polynomial. And uh, this is uh, written by the 
polynomial of elementary symmetric function, polynomial. Then we set, uh, we, then we substitute V into H by this formula. So in particular, we take V tensor L, uh, so fun, we, we take uh, L times rep L times tensor of fu fundamental representation. This gives a tautological bundle on the projective space. So in this case, left hand side is computed e easily. And the, on the other hand, right hand side is this form. So we can get a, a building block of the right hand side in this way. So uh, so, so uh, in the right hand side, we, we can uh, uh, expand Roland into Roland, pol Roland polynomial. So then we, we get apply we, we get apply this formula to get compute right hand side. So in, in the principle, uh, we can explicitly compute the right hand side. And we want to remark some points. So the similar Pitchford formula holds for Grassmann bundle, for vector bundle, over base manifold. So this is uh, this is also given by the wall crossing formula, and this is, this was also given by Weber Zirenkiewicz. And the second. Weber Zirin Kibik use a Jeffrey Kawa method. And this is a very different method from ours. And uh, obtains a similar residue formula for more general types of flag variables. So unfortunately, uh, we at the present uh, we don't know how, how to get uh, similar results for another type of flag manifold using uh, our method. Uh, so, but uh, today I, I want to introduce a, another direction. So then uh, we, we get the hypergeometric transformation formulas. So I, I want to introduce uh, frame the quiver representation. So we introduce the following settings. So let the Q be quiver with relations. This, this means Q0 is a set of vertices, Q1 is a set of arrows, and Q2 is a set of relations. And we write starting point out A and ending point in A. Then pass is a consecutive arrow like this. And we consider the pass algebra. Uh, this is generated by pass, uh, every, uh, all pass. Then, uh, then con 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 concatenation of pass gives a multiplicative structure of this vector space. And the uh, relation is uh, kind of just uh, linear relation among the paths. Then we, we consider algebra CQ over uh, ideal generated by relations, where this means the two-sided ideal generated by relations. Then a uh, module over this algebra are called Q representations. So we, we interpret it in another way. So, so we remark that the vertices is also the path length of length zero. So this gives a pro projector and uh, we have a decomposition of module over the path algebra. So then 
representation is also defined as follows. So we, we have a Q0 graded vector space. So we have a vector space over each vertices. Then representation is a collection of matrices uh, in, this, in this space. And uh, for each relation, we can evaluate a relation by representation. So Q, Q representation is interpreted as a collection of matrices which satisfy this equation for any uh, relations. So our uh, our modular space is uh, this representation. Uh, our, our modular space consisting of this representation, uh, uh, modulo conjugacy, uh, modulo conjugacy uh, action, uh, conjugate, con modulo conjugate. And uh, we, we assume that uh, some, some components are one dimensional. And then this special vertex is called the framing vertex. And uh, the pair of quiver and the framing vertex is called the framed quiver. So we, 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 get, we take generic stability parameter and set this value according to stability parameters. Uh, then the definition is uh, of stability is follows. So rho is zeta semi-stable if this equation falls for any sub-representation. Then a uh, framed quiver, a uh, framed modular space of framed quiver representation uh, is given by this set. Uh, so where, where I, I is the index set, the, the, uh, removed, and we removed infinity framing vertex. So then uh, alpha is the fixed dimen dimension vectors. And uh, I, I want to, I would like to present some example of framed moduli of framed representations. So let us introduce the following notations. So we, we said uh, if we have R arrow from infinity to index i, we, 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 we write this symbol. And if we have R arrow from index i to the framing vertex, uh, we, we use this symbol. Uh, then we, these R arrows, Form, forming, forms uh, R dimensional vectors map from R dimensional vector space. And this R arrow form map from, map to the R dimensional vector space. So we, we get the uh, uh, diagonal torus actions. So this is a uh, Grassmannian. This gives a Grassmannian. So this is the simplest and fundamental example. And we have some variants of Grassmannian. Then we get wall crossing. So in this setting, 
wall crossing formula gives a, a source identity uh, derived by Kirilov Nomi and uh, Mimachi Nomi. Uh, this is joint work with Mo Motegi. What Kirilov? What Kirilov? Anatoly or Alexander? Uh, Which Kirilov? Uh, Anatoly. <laughs> Ours. Yes. And uh, more, in more general, uh, flag manifold is uh, given in this example. So since uh, we have uh, this kind of uh, isomorphism. And uh, another example is a quiver variety of type A. And this is just a double of the previous example. And uh, we, we take some relations. And uh, we, we, we also have another kind of example. This gives a framed moduli space on the projective plane. So th this gives a moduli of a vector bundle of a pro projective plane. And uh, this is also known as the Jordan Cleaver variety. And this is a framed moduli space on the blow up. And this, well, in this case, all crossing formula proves blow up formula. And this is a previous research by Nakajima Yoshioka. And we also have, a, we can also consider the moduli of vector bundle on minus two curve. And this is given by this diagram. And uh, today I want to focus on this example. So th this is called the chainsaw quiver variety. And uh, another name is affin Roman space. And the special case of affin Roman space gives the following part. Uh, so th this is a joint work with uh, Awata, Hasegawa, Kanno, Shakiro, Shiraishi, Yamada. And uh, in this case, the generating function of integral over moduli space gives a solution to the QQ Pandube 6 equation. Uh, here, QQ Pandube means quantum Q Pandube equations. Uh, this, this is introduced by Hasegawa and Shakiro. And in, the, in, the, in, this, in, in this proof, uh, we, we, we reduce equation to Q, QKZ, QKZ equation, uh, which is regarded as a quantum deformation of the Schrodinger system, uh, first proposed by Lesha Chikin. And uh, in the differential case, Nagoya proved uh, this. But our situation is Q difference equations. And, and so this is a very different method to, from today's method. So I, ah, yes. So we, 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 we take a, Vector space, but uh, we we vary we we change we vary vector space on these vertices, and then so we we can consider the generating series. Uh, so, uh, uh, so later I will <laughs> introduce generating series. I beg your pardon. Yeah, thank you. Uh, so we, we consider the torus and uh, another equivalent parameter. For then we can consider the Gesellerotic Euler class uh, by the 
by this way. So, so So, uh, so for each case-theory class, we take dual of dual and wedge product. Then Chan character gives uh, our definition of Euler, case-theoretic Euler class. Uh, so when, when we substitute T into, we substitute T to the, B, uh, so when, when T equal one, we, we, we get the, Euler number, ah, usual Euler number. So then, the T equivalent sort of class is defined as follows. Yes. So, the case theoretic integral is defined by this way. So, so, for simplicity, the fixed point set is, we, we assume fixed point set is equal to one point. So, so that means we take a kind of course modular space. So, we have a map from our framed modular to the course modular space. Then we assume the fixed point set of course modular space is equal to one point. And this gives a, this implies the connected components of the fixed point sets of our fixed uh, frame moduli has fi finite, finite connected components. So, then the case theoretic integral is given by these equations. And uh, in, in terms of more, uh, in the more explicitly, we, we have these equations. So, so then, we, we get, we consider the T equivalent Chowling to compute integral. Uh, and then, then we can take multiplicative set and uh, localization in this way. And uh, our wall crossing formula gives a difference in terms of uh, combinatorial way. So here we, we take stability parameter uh, from two sides or across a wall. Yes. But uh, today I want to omit uh, ex explicit form of our wall crossing formulas. And uh, I, I want to focus on Chains of equivalent varieties. So we call that chain of equivalent variety is this this diagram. And when we take uh, stability parameter from this direction, this region, we, 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 this chains of equivalent variety is called the affine Lomot space. And uh, when we take opposite side, we call, we call it the dual of affine Lomot space. So this is a, uh, explicit construction. And we can take tautological bundle uh, as in the Grassmannian case. So we, we take case theory class, which gives a tan tangent bundle over modular space. 
and uh, some variants. Yeah, if yeah, we 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 take new torus acting on trivially. And the partition function is given by this way. So each coefficient is given by integral over framed quiver, framed moduli space of framed quiver representations. So here we change V. This means the dimension vector of the, of the framed quivers. So here, the above two is have a parameter t, but uh, this two series has uh, not, uh, for, for that series, we substitute t equal to one. And these generating series have very complicated duality. So then uh, we, we, I want to state the conjecture, our conjecture for first series. So let us introduce the uh, infinite product and the double infinite product and triple infinite product. Then first conjecture states that uh, if we take framing just uh, one dimensional, then generating series uh, factorized as uh, products. And the uh, second, when framing is all equal, then we have same generating series. And in fact, when n equal one, uh, we have, uh, we, we have a proof of conjecture. And further, furthermore, uh, so we, we, do, we do not have another case, but for in general, I assume, when we assume conjecture, then we have this kind of uh, formula for any framing. And the second conjecture, is about uh, that series. Then uh, we got uh, this kind of transformation formula. So unfortunately, in this conjecture, that we do not have a factorized form. So we, we only have a summation. So it's a very complicated. But uh, when we specialize some parameter, we, we, we also have factorization of the coefficients. So in the rest of the time, I will give a proof of conjecture for special case. So we consider the, this diagram. So this means uh, n equal to two and uh, one variable, one variable of generating series is equal to zero. In this case, conjecture one and conjecture two falls. So we change some, we, we want to change, uh, we, we need to change some notation. So we use index zero and one and uh, we substitute these parameters. Then uh, we have a, a 
uh, this kind of uh, explicit form of uh, generating series. And uh, we, we have a theorem about for conjecture one. So then uh, I, I want to remark that when framing is equal, this theorem becomes the uh, equality of the two series. And uh, this transformation formula has been already studied in, in these people. The Langer, Shirasa, Warner, and uh, Holness, Langman, Novi, Rosengren. And uh, I taught from Novi san. Uh, so this equation implies above in, in equations by taking limits. And for the latter conjecture, we, we, ah, we, we, we want to introduce Forel transformation like this. Then uh, we get a factorized form of uh, functional equations. And finally, I want to introduce some multiple hypergeometric series. So th this is the definition of Kajihara Nomi's basic multiple hypergeometric series. Then uh, Kajihara shows that this uh, transformation formula. And we remark that after some substitution, our theorem reprove this, uh, this transformation formula. Uh, or more precisely, this transformation formula is equivalent or identical to our transformation formula. So finally, we remark that uh, Yoshida also deduced these transformation formula from physics arguments. And uh, as I mentioned, uh, we reproved the source identity. And uh, it is known that source identity and the principal specialization also give the Kajihara's theorem. Yes. Yeah. This is, that's all. Thank you. Are there some questions? Uh, thank you for the talk. Uh, so this plus minus a joint is like two stability conditions yes. for Lamont. Yes. And are there only two? Stability conditions. Is there uh, only two options? Uh, yeah. In fact, Anna, uh, we, we have various stability parameters. So we, it, it, it's, it's, this is a difficult point to generalize this our theorem. Yes, thank you. Okay, more questions? Okay. Let's have speaker again.